On Friday, French archaeologists unearthed the remains of First World War soldiers who were killed almost 100 years ago. Local volunteers discovered the remains at the Le Mans de Massages site after they started to dig out a network of tunnels and trenches that had been filled in by farmers after the war. The location was a key strategic point between the Champagne and Argonne fronts during the war, as both German and French forces took control of it during the conflict. So far, the dig has unearthed nine soldiers and, according to regional curator of archaeology Yves de Fosses, the team are not stopping at just excavation. The archaeologist wants to carry out a work of study as well, a work of an anthropologist on the skeleton. So, for example, to determine the age, the state of health of the person, their stature as well, their physical state. By examining personal effects found on the bodies, de Fosses and his team are hoping to identify the soldiers, although this can be particularly sensitive considering how recent World War I was. You would never have the photo nor the name of a Roman or of a Gaul, whereas there you are going to start excavating a body while saying to yourself, you're going to perhaps be able to identify them, find a part of their family. So it's still an imperceptible connection which is nonetheless created between the person excavated and the excavator. Many of the soldiers killed on this front will never be found. So the discovery of these bodies is a particularly emotional experience for everyone involved and has contributed to a greater understanding of how soldiers were buried during the First World War.